What's holding you back from pursuing your goals, your idea, um, whatever it is that you want to do? It's not your friends, it's not your family members, it's not co-workers, it's you. It's you. It's an internal fear. It's something that um, you feel that you need other people to validate you or to come along with you or to give you that, um, that go ahead to move forward. For example, you may have the idea of wanting to lose weight, but you're you. But in order for you to go to that gym, you need that friend to come along with you. But maybe their goal is not your goal. Maybe their vision. Um, maybe they're saying they want to lose weight, but they really don't want to lose weight or want to put in the effort to lose weight. So, but you really, really do. So instead of you actually working out or changing your diet or eating healthier. Um, you don't do it because they're not doing it and they're not motivating you or encouraging you to do it. So I would share the thing that's holding you back is one, fear, and two, lack of motivation. So find out what motivates you and pursue it. No longer wait for someone else to validate you or to motivate you and encourage you to pursue or do or go after the thing that you really want to do. So I'm going to give an example of um, experience of actually wanting to go to this um, particular event. Uh, it was a networking event. And um, I happened to call someone that I know who I assumed that probably would be interested in going. So she did share with me that she was interested in going. But one of her excuses was that she didn't have the money to go. So I told her, you know what, don't worry about it. I got you. We'll, I'll handle it. Um, just come on. So then the next excuse was the car. Uh, so I said, listen, I will drive, just get to me and I will, we'll, we'll, I'll drive to the location. And after, after that, the third excuse was, was after, uh, the third excuse was, well, there was another excuse, put it that way, third and fourth excuse. And at the end of the day, what she shared was she really, really wants to go. But there were so many reasons that discouraged her, or met so many excuses that she gave herself not to go. And by the time uh, uh, we finished talking and going back and forth, back and forth about going and how we're getting there and so forth, um, and hearing the several excuses, I longer, I decided just I'm not even going to bother to go anymore. And so what could have been a great opportunity and network for me, I allowed myself to not go because this person, this individual didn't want to go. And um, what I noticed is that when she was talking, she was talking about a lot of things that was, talked about a lot of, of things that she was afraid of doing, afraid of going, and she didn't, because the car wasn't fixed or um, she didn't have the money and maybe she was going to be embarrassed if she got there and didn't have the money, even though these, these things were already going to be provided for her, which is my, which was going to be my vehicle, which is going to be the support um, to, uh, to, in terms of um, financial. But there was still other reasons. And at the end of the day, it was really just fear of the unknown. It's just fear. And sometimes we allow fear to hold us back. So find out why you're fearful. Release that fear so you can move forward in achieving the goals that you really want to achieve. And second is find out what motivates you and pursue the thing that motivates you. Because if you're really not motivated to to go or do something, you're not gonna you're not gonna put in the effort, and you're gonna feel like all the time that you need somebody else to accompany you or validate you or pursue, per, uh, encourage you or push you. So I would just basically share those are the reasons of, of being stuck. And so I had learned my reason as well, and um, and realized one, I cannot wait on other people to pursue the thing that I want to pursue. Maybe that's something I want and something you want. Maybe you, you have a dream of vision and goal and they don't want that. They, they're not as dedicated to it or motivated. So move forward to whatever it is that you need and want for yourself because you know what it is that you need and you know where you're trying to go and you know the goals that you have for yourself. So that's what I would share with you today and um, it was a lesson that I learned also and realizing push push past the fear get fear out the way and move forward motivate yourself and stop waiting for other people to accompany you validate you 
or um, be on board with whatever it is that you want for your life. This is your life and make the best of it. All right, thanks for watching. Have a beautiful, blessed day. I'm wishing you and your loved ones much love, joy, peace, health, wealth, and success.